Before you hear the rest of the talk, you have some time to look at questions 16 to 20. Now listen and answer questions 16 to 20. Right. Now I'd just like to make a few points about the plays we're going to see. Partly because it might influence your choice of clothes to take with you. The play we're seeing on Wednesday evening is a modern one, and we're going to the premiere. So it'll be quite a dressy occasion though, of course, you don't have to dress formally. I gather it's rather a multimedia production, with amazing lighting effects and a soundtrack of electronic music, though, unfortunately, the playwright is ill and is unlikely to be able to attend. On Thursday, we're seeing a play that was first performed last year, when it was commissioned to mark a hundred years since the birth in the town of a well-known scientist. We're going to see a revival of that production, which aroused a lot of interest. Friday's play will really make you think hard about what clothes to pack, as it'll be in the garden of a palace. It's a beautiful setting, but I'd better warn you, there won't be much protection from the wind. On Saturday, we're going by coach to a theatre in another town, not far from Munich. This will be the opening of a drama festival, and the mayor and all the other dignitaries of the town will be attending. After the performance, the mayor is hosting a reception for all the audience, and there'll be a band playing traditional music of the region. And after having a day off on Sunday... Our final play is on Monday, and it's in the stunning setting of the Old Town Hall, which dates back to the 14th century. The performance marks the 50 years that the lead actor has been on stage, and the play is the one where he made his first professional appearance all those years ago. And the day after that, we'll be flying back home. Now. Have you got any questions before I move?